In order to make ends meet, some bus and van operators in Johor Bahru have resorted to selling off their assets in hopes of being able to soldier through the COVID-19 pandemic. Some were even willing to let go of their vehicles at 40% lower than the market price in a desperate bid to sustain themselves. 49-year-old school bus and van operator Hussein Karamdin, who has been in the business for over 18 years, said he had sold four vans in just eight months. Yeah, betul. Sekiranya pandemik ini berpanjangan, kita terpaksa korbankan uh, sebijik lagi untuk uh, meneruskan kehidupan, kelangsungan kehidupan dan kita juga perlu bayar gaji-gaji driver yang ada dengan kita. Bus driver Ismail Sari used to drive across the Johor Singapore border regularly to ferry passengers. However, it has been close to a year since he last touched the steering wheel of a bus. Memang kita berharap pasal kita punya laluan pun memang Singapore sahaja. Singapore sahaja. Ha, pasal kita punya bus uh, macam VVIP. Mm-hmm. So kalau kata jalan lakin, macam kata bukan kata balik modal, rugi lagi ada. Oh. Pasal company lain kan 27 seat, 30 seat, mm. macam kita 18 seat. Berapa tiket kita nak jual? Meanwhile, Johor Mofakat Bus Operators and Drivers Association Chairman R. Tegarajan said of its 100 members, only about 50% were operating. Kebanyakan syarikat, syarikat pelancongan dan juga syarikat bas sekolah ini mengambil keputusan untuk menghentikan operasi dan menutup syarikat mereka di mana mereka akan menjual aset mm-hmm. mereka iaitu macam bas sekolah, van uh, sekolah mereka dan mengambil duit itu untuk melaburkan dalam bidang yang mereka rasa boleh sebat lah. Oh. Uh, mereka dah give up dengan industri pengangkutan, senang cerita. Tiga Rajan added that despite not being able to move, the bus operators still have to maintain the vehicles and pay their monthly loan installments as well as road tax and insurance.